Hello people of YouTube. I've made several videos here lately about the Star Trek Starship magazines and the ships that they send and uh, I thought I would take a moment to take a little break from that especially since I'm between shipments and there hasn't been any problems lately which is a good thing and show you what's on my shelf behind me where I've started putting the ships up and I've also got another Starship collection down below. So let me get a little closer. As you can see up top, we have the Star Trek Starships collection and the different forms. You know, you've got the alien ships over here, if you will. And over here, I've started the Federation ships. But down here, on the shelf below, I've got my old micro machine collection. And I'm using a light to help illuminate this because unfortunately this shelf is pretty dark if I turn the lights off but I've got it's very hard to see so at some point I'm going to work on lighting in this cabinet but these are all the well not all of the Star Trek micro machines there are but it's my collection I started gathering these micro machines when they first came out I was what was it, 96, 97? I was actually working for Walmart at the time and was able to collect. I basically got to shop while I worked because I cleaned the floors. And I could see these ships in the three packs as they came out. So every time I saw a new one, I jumped on it. And over time, I ended up getting amassing this entire collection. Slightly different view here with the light. Got all the Federation ships over here. Now I bought these in the three packs as they came out. I didn't buy any of the collection sets. And now I realize that was a mistake. At the time, because as soon as these came out in three packs, I got them. When the collections came out, I looked at them and I said, oh no, I've already got all these ships. I've been collecting them in the three packs. So I don't need the collections as well. And so I didn't buy them, which wasn't a problem until later, years later I realized one or two of those collection sets actually came with ships that you couldn't get in three packs, namely the Collector Pack 3, which I've managed over time to get a couple. I've got the Future Enterprise here that came with one of those sets that otherwise I wouldn't have had. But those sets are very expensive. I hate that I missed it back in the day. If I could go back and, and pick one of those sets up, I definitely would. But these are all the micro machines I have. Quite a few Federation chips. And you know, I've got a couple of duplicates here and there from different packs that I bought. I think I may have bought one or two duplicate packs by mistake. And as you go around, you can kind of see. You can kind of see the, the Klingons and the Romulans and some Borg and Cardassians and several ships from like DS9 and Voyager that I can't remember all their names now. But this is my Micro Machine collection. So I've had this for quite a long time. I'm looking to get a few more as time progresses. I've obviously opened them all. But these things have followed me across the United States and back again from all of my mini moves and little boxes because they don't take up much room. And over here I have the silver plated or I can't remember I think it was silver or platinum plated collections that they came out with. All of my Starship collections were on these two ships or on my um, micro machines but I started moving them to the other shelf because I recently got that but I haven't moved these I might not move these I'm not sure but they came out with I think it was two boxes maybe three where they were silver plated and it was neat and I, those are collections that I did pick up because I didn't have them and I had the money and I was young and yeah so those over here also last year I ran into someone that was selling 
last year I ran into someone that was actually selling the bronze collector set and these are still in the box and the bronze collector sets pretty much the same more or less as the silver you've got one package over here we've got the one package over here that had the different enterprises and then a space a shuttle and a runabout this here's the original the um, movie refit or the A and then you've got the B no B C and then D and then over here was the adversary set I believe it says on there somewhere but anyway these are the Klingon and Romulan mostly Klingon and Romulan and one Borg yeah those are all Klingon and Romulan ships and one Borg ship but it was the same lines as the silver down here I don't believe there was a third one of the bronze there was more of the silver because you've got all the enterprises like that and you've got the Klingon and Romulan but you've also got DS9, the Cardassian, the um, oh gosh, what is that from Star Trek 3? I can't think of it now. You've got Frangi, you've got Stargazer, the Reliant Space Station. Okay. Those are all my Micro Machine collections. So that's enough show and tell for now. Those are my other Star Trek ship collections. I plan on getting more ships in the future. I've got my eye on a set of Star Wars uh, model sets that I would like to get. A couple of different ones. I would like to eventually add the Galactica and Pegasus from um, Battlestar Galactica to my collection. And as I gather those, if I, you know, when I buy them and put them together, I'll definitely make some videos. And in the meantime, thank you for watching. And if you have any questions or comments. Leave them down below and uh, keep on keeping up.